In this video, we're going to go over Windows color filters and how you can use it to invert the colors on your screen. Hi everyone, it's Carrie from Live Accessible, and if you're like me and you like to have white text on a dark background, you might want to try out Windows color filters. You could use it to invert the colors on your screen, and you can use it with or without magnifier, which I do know there are people who do want it inverted, but do not use magnifier, so this is a really great solution for you. And also, sometimes the Control alt i keyboard shortcut does not work for some reason, even when you have magnifier on. So Color Filters has another keyboard shortcut that hopefully will work better for you. First, make sure your computer is up to date. Now let's go over to my computer and I can show you how it works. So here I am on the desktop and what you want to do first is go to your settings. So you can press Windows key I or you can search it on the search field in the start menu and go to ease of access. So I'm going to zoom in so I can see. And on the left side, there's some options here. What you wanna do is go to color filters. And here you can turn it on. And here you can press the checkbox that um, allows you to use the shortcut key, which is Windows Control C. Besides just the regular inversion, there's also grayscale, grayscale inverted, and then some other um, color filters for people that have certain issues with certain colors. And there's a little color wheel on the bottom so that you can have a visualization of what the colors are going to look like. So for example, I am on um, our website, and if I scroll down here where there's some text, I can press Windows Control C and it will turn on the color filters. You can do this with or without magnification. And then so here you can see how it inverts all of it, um, including the pictures, however. So if you don't want that to happen, um, sometimes websites do have their own um, high contrast filter. So I'll turn on ours. And so that keeps the pictures while changing the text into white text on a dark background. But unfortunately, not all websites have that option and it would be really nice if every website could have some kind of accessibility like that so that you can still view the pictures but consume the whatever text that they have. So that's how you use the Windows color filters. There's other things you can do to invert the colors on your screen or have it white text on a dark background, like having windows in dark theme, which I did a video on, and I will link that up here and down in the description below. And sometimes applications like Chrome have their own high contrast solution that you can try out and sometimes different websites have a dark mode. So I'll also be doing more videos on those. And if there's something that you'd like me to do a video on, leave that down in the comments below. So if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up below and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for more videos on technology, products, and encouragement for people who are blind and visually impaired. You can also visit our Amazon shop. That's amazon.com slash shop slash live accessible. That link will also be down in the description. And you can check out some ideas of accessible technology and things that we use or daily living aids or even some products for low vision children. That doesn't increase your price or anything and that just goes towards supporting the channel and we appreciate that. Thanks for watching everyone and I will see you in the next video.